Hello, this is Edward Peters. I'm going to do a Gematria analysis of a news article from today's Concord Monitor, Tuesday, August 18, 2015, called Nation's Oldest Veteran Dies at Age 110. 110 stands out. The story is about a Michigan woman. Her name is Emma Didlake, or Didlocky, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, who's believed to be the nation's oldest veteran at 110, and she's died about a month after meeting President Obama in the Oval Office. Didlake was a 38-year-old wife and mother of five when she signed up in 1943 for the Women's Army Auxiliary Corps, and she served there as a private and a driver. She, um, so she got to meet the president on July 17th. I have a link to his comments and his introduction to her uh, below the video. You can check that out if you like. Um, she died this past Sunday. I got the date up here. Where did she die? Yes, on the 16th of August. Um, using the date calculator, it's 38 days uh, before September 23rd, which is the, the date that's been pushed in propaganda, their subtle numero numerological propaganda so often. So 38 is the number of death. She was 38 when she enlisted in the, in the military. Um, this has Freemasonic... Uh, fingerprints all over this article. Uh, I also noticed that uh, Didlake in Jewish Gematria, excuse me, Emma Didlake, as a whole name of Jewish Gematria amounts to 119. Uh, it's uh, Emma is 66. Well, where, are we, where is it? Let's aim this darn camera. Got to get a better one. 66 for Emma, 53 for Didlake, 119 total. So you got the 9-11, 110. The World Trade Center was 110 stories. Uh, Adolf Hitler in Simple English Gematria is 110. Presidents, 110. Where's my numbers? I got all kinds of pages of shit here. Just a moment. Do do do. Uh, Rockefeller is 110. Osama bin Laden is 110. World Trade Center 110 stories. And in English Gematria, World Trade Center is 1110. So you have 110 in there. Um, something I ask you folks in Gematria who are wiser than me in this. Does adding zeros to any number of importance magnify it? For example, they had the, uh, the mayor of Los Angeles had 96 million balls released into their reservoir. Obviously the 96 is a reference to Freemason. Freemason is 96, a simple English to Matria. But does the, the millions, is it like shouting 96 as opposed to just a plain old 96? That's what I have, I'm asking about. Does that make these 11s all the more important? Adolf Hitler, 110. Present, 110. 110 stories. Does it mean something else? Does it mean you something you throw away? Adolf Hitler was used in eliminated. Osama bin Laden was used and eliminated. Used to be a CIA asset. Will Rockefeller, well, he's still being used now. Presidents get thrown away when they're no longer needed. Uh, just as a matter of, of interesting coincidence, Pope Francis in Latin Kabbalah simplex gematria is 110 also. Is he going to be used and eliminated? He's coming to America to meet the president, speak to Congress, and go to Philadelphia. So this has Freemasonic fingerprints all over it. Uh, I believe I have an article. Yes, I do. I will link to the Concord Monitor article online so you can read it as well. Um, there's other things that might be of interest here. I have not yet dissected. The charity that sent uh, Emma did like to meet the president was called Talons Out Honor Flight. Uh... I have not cut uh, dissected the gematria of that. So, uh, yeah, so you got the 38, you got the 110s, you got the 119. Uh, this is definitely Freemasonic propaganda. Oh, there's another interesting part here uh, in the story. Oh, shit, my thing froze up again. Where, uh,. I don't even know if I'm recording now, because YouTube's freezing up on me. I don't know if this is supposed to happen. It's just a glitch. 
or what? Oh, here we go. I see my voice again. Uh, it said that Talon's Out officials presented her, the, the lady with a short sleeve shirt bearing the group's logo to wear on the trip to Washington. Did like took a look and said, I don't have Michelle Obama arms. I'm going to need a jacket. Now, Michelle Obama has very you know, strong masculine arms, and I don't know if that's significant in any way. Like, why mention Michelle Obama's arms? Why even mention that part of the story? I mean, she's wearing a jacket now in the picture. Uh, anyway, I'd like to hear your comments, your corrections, your criticisms, your thoughts, and I wish you peace, and I, and I wish you joy, and I don't let these assholes get you down. Because, uh, and if, if you're one of these people, if you're a Freemason, you're involved in the propaganda and the brainwashing, then I encourage you to uh, stop. Just quit. I don't wish you any harm. I just wish you would stop doing it. It's not worth it. Okay, see ya.